So, I mean, uh, what's happening here anyhow? What are the potentials? Well, me personally, I'm here for a different reason. I'm here representing what they own, but I'm here for my own personal reasons. You know? Can you I, share that yeah, too? Yeah, I can share that. Okay, I just come on doing 24 yeah. years, right? And I come on doing 24 years, December 28th. Uh, I was locked the majority of my life. Uh, when I came home, I had no parole. Uh, the parole system, I think it's not fair because when you come home, you don't have parole. They really don't have anything for you. They give you a bus ticket and they give you $25. Now imagine you don't have nobody out here doing nothing for you or everybody passed away or you was raised in foster homes. All that play a part in life. I was one of those kids. I was raised in community green. I come up as a, a bad child of society, doing things that I should have did, made bad choices. But I made right choices when I found God. Now, personally, I'm not mad at the system. I'm just mad that people don't look and get a second chance to people that deserve a second chance. Now, it feels good to be out of here, but it feels bad because I don't really know my direction like what I do as I, after I met this group. I'm learning my direction. I'm learning that I'm doing great in, God, in God's eyes because it keeps me safe. I'm homeless because I don't have my own key. But I'm not homeless because I don't act like I'm homeless. And I don't act, I don't act the way of a homeless person act. That's y'all call of homeless. Me, I'm just a person that's looking for a new home and a new life. And I found it when I met these people here. Now, they represent the same thing I represent, but I'm representing the guys that's in jail. That's coming home, don't have nobody out here doing nothing for them. And they did a lot of time, and, and, and they made wrong choices, but they're making right choices now because God let them come home. But when they come home, they don't got nothing to come home to. All they know is they're getting off the bus, and they got to make the right choice. It's going to believe in God going to let me, guide me through this, or it's going to go rob them in again and get the rest of my life. Me, I don't know what they're going to do, but me, I know what I'm going to do. I'm not going to rob nobody. I'm going to keep waking up, telling God about them, and trying to do the right thing. But it's hard because when you don't know what the right thing is, it's hard. But when you be around people that's trying to do the right thing, I guess it come easy. So all I can do is just learn what they doing and they learn what I'm doing. I'm representing the guys in jail. I'm representing people that's coming home with 30 years, 40 years, I ain't got no life and nothing to go to. And maybe might make the right decision. I'm hoping the system change. It might not, but me, I don't understand why I'm having a hard time getting a job and I'm filling out applications. And, and I've been living here 44 years in Chicago. Well. I went to jail when I was 19, but you know what I'm saying? I came home when I was 43. I mean, 44. I'll be 45 this year, no real night. But I'm not going to give up because I'm going to struggle, get harder, but it get easier. So all I got to do is keep telling God I love him, keep doing the right thing, and maybe somebody will believe me. If I was on the road, I wouldn't be in this situation. Yeah. I wouldn't be home because I have a situation where I have a choice. What I'm trying to say is that when you on parole, when you off parole, you don't have the same chance as you have when you come on, on parole. When you in jail and you do all your time and they let you out, you on your own. Ain't nothing there for you. Well, if you have a road, they got things set up for you, like work release, you know, them things, you know what I'm saying, day labor, you know, certain things like shelters, things that help you find you somewhere to live. Well, if you ain't on parole, they don't find you nothing. Just put you out there. Yeah. 